Hello and welcome to the news in Bahrain International with me, Keith Johnston. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa sent a cable of congratulations to Tunisian President Kais Saeed on the occasion of his country's Republic Day. His Majesty the King wished President Saeed abundant health and happiness and the brotherly Tunisian people for their progress and prosperity. The Ministry of Industry, Trade and Tourism has announced the date for the application of the second stage of the list of degradable plastic products which will come into effect on Saturday. The Assistant Under Secretary for Domestic and Foreign Trade in the Ministry, Sheikh Hamad bin Salman Al Khalifa, stated that the monitoring of plastic food table cover products comes within the second stage of the joint monitoring programme between the Ministry of Industry, Trade and Tourism and the Supreme Council for the Environment to implement the Ministerial Decision No. 11 of 2019 concerning the issuance of the technical regulations for plastic products related to changing the specifications of the basic products circulating in the local markets to be environmentally friendly and decompose more quickly after exposure to environmental natural factors. Sheikh Hamad bin Salman Al Khalifa emphasised the readiness of the local factories to initiate the requirements of the second stage of the regulation, as the most recent statistics conducted by the administration indicate that most of the local factories are fully prepared and ready. In light of the second phase of the banning of non-degradable plastic products across the kingdom, joining us on the line now is Ms. Intisa Abdul Al, who is Chief of Standards Implementation and Quality Assurance at the Ministry of Industry, Commerce and Tourism. Good evening, Ms. Intisa. Good evening to you. Good evening. Recently, there has been a lot of talks about banning plastic table covers across the country. So will these plastic products be banned? Uh, first, I would like to thank you for giving me this opportunity to deliver a message to all citizens and residents of Kingdom of Bahrain. Uh, I would like to assure that these products will be uh, still uh, available at Bahrain local markets for the same price and quality. Uh, the only difference in this new plastic product will come with the new specifications that enable plastic products to degrade faster than before, um, meaning that its life cycle will be shorter than before in the environment. So basically the new requirements reflect the type of plastic used in the manufacturing. So what is the purpose of these changes? As you know, uh, this is a big step forward for the Kingdom of Bahrain in the fight against uh, plastic pollution. Currently, 30% of household waste in Bahrain consists of uh, plastic waste. Therefore, an action was taken to protect our environment, uh, the wildlife and the marine life. In addition to marine life, a study has shown that by year 2050, uh, the oceans could have more plastic than fish. And when will these requirements be implemented? Uh, starting from tomorrow, 25th of July, the new requirements will be enforced uh, as a part of the second phase of the Ministerial Resolution Number 11 uh, for year 2019 regarding the technical regulation for plastic products. Uh, where the first stage was enforced last year since um, July 2019, covering the essential plastic products uh, like uh, grocery bags, garbage bags, and laundry bags. Uh, moreover, it is very important to note that the local factories and manufacturers in Bahrain are ready and fully ready to provide uh, degraded table cover products in the shops and local markets. And we encourage all the public to buy these degraded products in order to protect the environment. Thank you for joining us, Ms. Intasar. As part of its commitment to execute law number 21 of 2020 on pension funds and various regulations that are related to it as per royal directives, the Social Insurance Organisation announced that it is now ready to receive queries at its headquarters as well as its branch in Seif Mall in Maharik during the period of the 23rd to the 30th of July. Operating hours during weekdays will be from 7.30 in the morning until 6 o'clock in the evening, while the headquarters will be open during formal holidays from 10am to 5pm. 
The SIO stressed the importance of taking all precautions, such as wearing masks and social distancing. It also announced establishing an official email service to facilitate its services to the citizens. The Ministry of Health said today that the number of active coronavirus cases reached 3,448, with 518 recoveries and 359 registered new cases. The Ministry also announced two deaths today of two men aged 66 and 61. This brings the total death toll to 136. The Ministry of Health urges everyone to adhere to the rules and affirm the importance of following instructions, such as washing one's hands with soap on a regular basis, along with avoiding shaking hands and close contact. Moreover, covering the nose and mouth when sneezing and avoiding public spaces when possible. A unique drive-in and dine concept featuring some of the finest cuisine complemented by music takes place at Trader Vic's car park every day from 5pm onwards until the restaurant is open again. Enjoy some of the finest flavors at the first of its kind gourmet food trucks in Bahrain. I really enjoy the vibes here. Um, it's actually something quite new to do during these uh, dark times, uh, at least we're out of the house, uh, being staying out, social distancing, being safe. Uh, but overall, it's a very nice experience. The plan was to start to order from every truck over here. So uh, we said we had dinner, we had sushi, we had a, uh, some uh, pizza, we had, a, um, we had something else, I can't remember. Uh, we had our drinks and now we're waiting for our dessert. The variety of cuisine complemented by music for a truly inviting atmosphere. Ah, it's fantastic. It's like a, it's better than the restaurant. I mean, people comes around. Um, there is a lot of different flavors. We have Italian. We have grill. We have uh, our sandwich is fantastic. We have very good response from uh, Bahrainian people. Very good. We are all happy. Uh, actually, we are selling a lot of pastas. Um, a lot of uh, grill. Today we have a beautiful lamb, uh, chicken, a little bit of everything. But I feel home in Italy because we're selling really a lot of pasta. Come, drive in and dine out. The food trucks are waiting.